the overall goal of this procedure is to successfully transform foreign DNA and knock down gene function in Pristianca specificus nematodes. For transgenesis, start by preparing the proper genomic DNA with compatible cohesive ends. For RNA interference, synthesize the gene of interest using a double-stranded RNA transcription kit. Then, microinject the Pristianca specificus gonads with a DNA or double-stranded RNA. Screen the F1 population for the selected marker phenotype in transgenesis and selected for the knockdown phenotype for RNA interference. For transgenesis, continue to monitor results of F2 transgenic worms to obtain results that show specific gene expressions using GFP reporter through fluorescence microscopy. Hi, I'm Ray Hong, California State University of Northridge, and uh, this demonstration will outline the steps for genetic manipulation in Pristianca specificus nematodes, an emerging model organism. Performing RNAi and transgenesis can answer key questions in developmental biology and behavior by characterizing gene functions and expressions. Individuals new to this method will benefit from viewing how to place the worm on the injection pad and to inject the worm on the correct focal plane where the gonads are visible. Unlike C. elegans gonads, the Bristianca specificus gonads cross each other dorsally and migrate eventually as the nematode develops from late J4 into adults. In addition, genomic DNA digested with compatible restriction enzymes should be added to your transgenes and co-injection marker to make your injection mix. Jessica Singapurman, a lab technician in my lab, will demonstrate micro-injection in Pristianca specificus.